Blessed them my people. So Shensia recently make a post on her Instagram status revealing the type of man who she would have seen herself with. You see my people? Now of course you know so Shensia is single right now. So a whole heap man I put up money, a whole heap man I put up certain type of offers to Shensia. You see me? Remember a hot girl something in you know, people. So she finally make a post revealing the type of man who she would have been interested in. You see my people? So you don't want to miss that. And also I want to talk about Dancehall Queen Spice reacting to some news that surfaced the other day. You see my people? And basically the Grammy Awards it has been postponed and of course you know say Spice is a Grammy nominee and a lot of persons feel like say out of all of the persons them who get nominated as she go win it you understand and of course she actually think that as well you have to have confidence in yourself you know so Spice I react to the news and things you see it people so those are the two things more want to talk about but before we get into them don't forget to like this video people don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn the notification bell on you see my people it is very important that you turn it on that way you get notified when I drop a new video. Is it people? So the first thing we're gonna talk about is a girl Shensia actually revealing the type of man who she want or who she would have see herself with. You understand people? And as I say, Shensia has been asked a lot of times if she in a relationship. She has said no. She even do an interview and I say it's been a while, good, good while you know, people since she actually do certain things. When you know me at all about do the naughty with somebody and things. So she has said it's been a while since she do any of that. Now, as I say my people, she make a post on her Instagram. Instagram status and this is what she said a woman got f with who treat her the best they don't care who got the most money you see it and she put up at the top part queen treatment only so basically she has said she's not about the money you understand what me i say man can forward with a whole heap of money that now got impress her you see it i remember you know people shensia already have her own money and them thing there so it a got hard for a man actually use that and impress her for a man win over she you know he must have come with like a genuine personality and just maybe be make her smile. They the fear and just do the right thing. You understand, people? You could have been poor. You could have probably... It don't even matter which part you work. Because sometimes, you know, when a woman attracted to a man, you know, it don't know, really matter the type of job where you have. She does pass all of them things. You understand, people? But Shensia also made a post on her Twitter page saying, if you try to make me feel like I'm not enough for you, I'ma leave. Because you are probably be right. The one who sees me as everything and more is still out there. You see it? So you have to make time for her. You have to make she feel special and all of that. And as I say... A woman like them, you will have them money and have them things. You can't come with no money and try to impress them because they're used to the good life and them things. You see me? But you have a whole heap of women out there, you know, people. Me I tell you, no, know, and money them work off for you. Know. You see, if you get a girl using money, does no say as soon as that run out, she gone leave you. Or if she book up on a man who have more money, remember, you know, people, once the way all you meet her, the same way so you might end up a loser. You understand? So if you try to impress her with Rolex watch and all them type of things, there, then it might not really work out for you in the future. You see me? A man might use a bigger watch and impressor and them things. So, yeah, that's how Shensia here offer some people. So, let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section. So, now we're going to move on to Dancehall Queen Spice reacting to the news about the Grammy being postponed and things. You see my people? So, I get into an article where speak on all of this, and you guys can tell me what you think about this in the comment section. So, the article says Spice says winning Grammy is more important than being at the ceremony grammy nominated queen of dancehall spice says winning the golden gramophone for the best reggae album at this year award ceremony is more important than being there physically she made a confession during an interview with tmz tv host charles and harvey earlier this week at the time they were discussing the prospects of the postponement of entertainment biggest night the grammy award have since been postponed the recording academy and cbs said in a joint statement on wednesday when quiz about whether she'd be good if the awards didn't take place as an organized ceremony this year the summer like it dj whose given name is grace hamilton responded no not really no i want it to happen she subsequently said that if she had to compromise winning would be more important than being present at a physical ceremony i mean i think to win is big she added i'm super excited i'm over the top i'm celebrating already a win i'm just happy to be nominated so whether i win this year or not 
I am officially a winner. Spice debut album 10 is up for the award. The other nominees for best reggae album are Pamoja by Etana, Live and Living by Sean Paul, Royal by Jesse Royal, Positive Vibration by Grams Morgan, and Beauty in the Silence by Soja. The winner was set to be announced at the award ceremony, which was slated for the Crypto.com Arena Family Staples Center in Los Angeles on Monday, January the 31st. However, in the joint statement on Wednesday, the recording Academy and CBS regrettably informed the public that the show will be rescheduled for a further date. After careful consideration and analysis with city and state officials, health and safety experts, the artist community and our many partners, the Recording Academy and CBS have postponed the 64th annual Grammy Award show, the statement said. The health and safety of those in our music community, the live audience and the hundreds of people who work tirelessly to produce our show remains our top priority. Given the uncertainty surrounding the CV-19, holding the show on January the 31st simply contains too many risks. We look forward to celebrating music biggest night on a future date, which will be announced soon. Last year, the ceremony was also scheduled to take place on January the 31st, but on January the 5th was postponed until March the 14th, according to Billboard, and was ultimately held outdoors. So yes, people, that's a go on and what a go on. You see, my people, so Spice wanted to keep whether she's going to be there personally or not, you understand, because she feel like she's going to win. But as she say, no, people, whether she really win or not, she's still a winner, you understand? Because remember, once you get nominated, that is already a big deal, you see me? So I want to big up all of the persons them who got nominated for a Grammy Award. Definitely a good look, you understand? Um, some good artists, you see it? So that is what Spice Officer people. Let me know what you guys think about this. And also, do you think that the Queen will come out on top based on the persons who she's going up against? Because my mind is Sean Paul, you know, people. Don't take him lightly. You understand what I say? Etana, good, good artist as well. You understand? Jesse Royal, good artist. So, you know, the nominees looking good. Yes, what I say, people. But um, some people might feel like say, Spice had a great year with Godong there and things. So, Maybe that might actually boost our chance. I don't know, people. Maybe. I'm just saying that, you see me. People don't really have said that, but I say maybe some people have think that because that song actually did wonders for Spice last year, is it? But let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section. And that's it, you know, people. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn the bell on. Bless upon yourself and keep safe. I'm out. What's up in here, cooking? Yes. And it tastes real good. Oh, okay, we're here on a party bus. Can I tell about that bus we's on with the swing? I'm gonna show you the pictures. No, that party bus was lit, lit, lit. And wait, and Spice was dropping it? <laughs> like it's hot. But make sure you watch the movie. Amazon, it's, on, it's Harlem on Prime. All right. You see that cute little setting we just had? Bohemian theme. The chef is here. A belly full, but I'll ask you. Let me show you, let me show you some of the food. Hold on. Come on, I really understand. That tree, that tree plate, me eat. Now I, now I power talk to my good, but from a food me I'm dead. <laughs> Yo, now I, you're going to love me. That's the leftovers. So you can just imagine. I should have shown you the setup. What did nice and cute? They did their thing. But let me flip the camera and show you guys around a little bit. This watch cute, watch pretty. But I'm gonna show her around real quick until I go find the girls, but what I mean if I from, from a food me after dead eh? a food me after dead eh? me not ask more until you know I'm showing you the people them house. Mm-hmm. I can't tell you all the world I was still on one nice bohemian team and everybody I eat like them stush. Two look a piece of two look a piece of lobster tail, two look a piece of um macaroni and cheese. A three times I go for my plate. You're crazy. Eh? What's the mad? Food still left over, I must be mad. 
But then I put a cute something there with them. A tree plate, my gopher. You're crazy? Must be mad. It was right. right? They, I think they took it up. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna go back and separate again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, Look here, my last. I wish back. I wish we. Wish we were for work. Then me not put that little blue ball here, and I'm a horse. Cutie. Horse big and nice. I'm gonna find the girl them real quick. Mm -hmm. So we are having a girls' night out. So let me flip the camera. We're having a girls' night out um, for the movie called Harlem. We're here with all the girls and we put on pajama. What's wrong? We put on with pajama. We're gonna have a, a little movie night. I'm gonna find the girls. So I wanna see what I want real quick before the movie starts. You enjoying yourself? I am. I am. Yeah. Let me flip the camera. Hello, <laughs> girls. Say hi. Hey, spice baby. <laughs> What's up, Juan? What's going on? Come on. Let me flip the camera. Come on, he wants to take off. I have food in my teeth. Let's make sure the food in my teeth. Anyway, all the girls are here. Let me show you everybody real quick before um, we head over. Where's Yandy? Oh, you're all alive. Welcome to my home. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Our dream was. I feel like my home. 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 Pick up on the cell. Pick up on the cell. 